In this demo, I will show you how to load CSV data from S3 using Graph Studio. Let's get started. Let's start by creating a simple vertex called person with some basic attributes. We have also generated some data with these attributes. Next, we will save the schema and create a graph using the vertex person. The graph creation may take a while, so please be patient. After the graph has been created, we can go to the Load Data tab. Click the Add Data File button to add a new data source. To add a new data source, we need our S3 access key and secret. This information can be found in AWS IAM. We have uploaded a CSV file in an S3 bucket. Now we can try to connect to this bucket. In the data source settings, we can choose the file format, delimiter, and other options. We can also see some sample data to ensure it looks as expected. Once verified, click Add. Now the data source has been successfully added. The next step is to do data mapping. Move the cursor slightly around the data file icon until it shows a crosshair, then click and drag to the vertex person to map the data to this vertex and release the cursor. On the right side, we can see the columns of the data source and the attributes of the vertex. Click and drag to connect the corresponding columns to the attributes. Click Save to save the mapping. Now the mapping is complete. We can click on the data file icon and then click the Start button to begin loading the data. Please wait patiently for the loading process to finish. Now the data has been loaded successfully. We can verify it within Graph Studio. And that's it. We've successfully loaded CSV files from S3 into TigerGraph using Graph Studio. Thank you for watching.